Hello everybody and welcome to the start of the KL vlogs. As you can tell, I'm not in KL yet. I'm still in Dubai, but I'm so excited. I'm going to KL for five days to stay with Isabella. I'm super excited to see her and to see the city. I've been to KL once before, but it was literally like five, maybe even six years ago on a school trip. So I'm really, really excited to see it again and kind of do more touristy things because I don't really remember much of it. Isabella has a really good itinerary planned. That's so Isabella. She literally sent it to me half an hour. I booked after I booked my flights and I also booked my flights like 10 days ago so this was very spontaneous we're heading to the airport in about half an hour I'm flying overnight so I think I leave Dubai at like half quarter past nine or something and then I arrive in KL at half eight KL time so it's quite good I get a full day there even though I've been flying for hand luggage in case you're interested I'm taking this bag which is from LK Bennett my friend Marissa got me this as a birthday present a few years ago and then for my big bag Ugh. I'm taking my Louis Vuitton Never Full. I love this bag and I feel like I don't get enough use out of it. So, because I don't like to take it to London because it doesn't have a zip, so it's not the safest. But I love to get as much use out of it as I can while I'm here. And then also, I'm taking this suitcase, which isn't actually mine, I think it's my dad's, but I only have a really big suitcase with me and I don't obviously need that much stuff only going for five days. So, I'm going to head to the airport and I will probably update you guys when I'm there and then again when I'm on the flight. If any of you guys are interested in what I wear to fly, I love to be comfy because I'm flying overnight. I'm wearing this short sleeve t-shirt from Ria Maria, it's just black. I also like to wear black when I'm traveling in case for any reason something gets spilt on what I'm wearing. It doesn't matter because it's black so you won't really see it. I'm wearing these super floaty comfy trousers from Oasis and I'm wearing my new black Chanel espadrilles which you will have seen if you watch my recent haul so be sure to check that out. So I'm now on the plane. I'm going to talk quietly because I don't want people to hear me. But actually, to be honest, there's literally no one here yet. I'm in my seat at my window, which I really like. I'm going to try and sleep most of the flight because I get in at, I think, half 8 a.m. Um, so I kind of want to be able to stay up for the whole day. So I'm going to try and literally get this mattress on and sleep the whole time. I've eaten a massive lunch, so I don't really want any food. So hopefully I can sleep the whole time. I just need to sort all my stuff out because I've got my bag down here and I've got some snacks so and I'll probably try and watch a movie and I'll fall asleep while I watch that but oh my god I'm so excited so I thought I'd just quickly nip to the toilet before take off I'm gonna take off my makeup and put on some moisturizer the music in here is so loud um because my skin does not cope well with overnight flights I personally prefer flying overnight but my skin doesn't thank me for it so I'm gonna I've got some Sephora makeup wipes with me. I'm going to take off and they're like cleansing wipes, not just proper like standard dodgy makeup wipes. And then I'm going to put my moisturizer on so hopefully my skin will stay a little bit hydrated and survive the flight. They just brought us around the little um, bags. You get these in overnight flights. It's got like a mirror, moisturizer, hairbrush, tissues, toothbrush, all those kind of things, which is really good for just before landing. And also I thought I'd show you the snacks I brought with me when I've got my champagne. I've got Sour Patch Kids, which are literally my favourite, which I probably shouldn't eat like just before I'm about to sleep. And these, which are the hummus chips, which are chilli and lemon, and these are literally my favourite things ever. So these are probably going to be like my dinner. Um, I like to bring snacks on the plane because I'm not a big... I can't really eat much on the plane because obviously I can't have gluten and dairy, so it's quite difficult. So I like to be well stocked up on snacks. And also, on a night flight, I don't really need that much food anyway so I don't really want a big meal but they do do breakfast in the morning and I think there's yogurt and granola on the menu they've not brought it yet but I looked at it before so that would be quite good um you literally can't see ending out the window it's so dark so guys it's now the next morning it's about 45 minutes till landing I've literally slept the whole flight I think I've slept for about five and a half hours and the flight is seven hours so morning I have eaten nothing. I had that one drink at the start. I literally just slept and I watched um, half of Dream, Girl um, Dream Girls, half of Mean Girls because I didn't want to watch anything new because I knew I'd fall asleep. So I've just gone to the toilet and like fixed myself. Obviously, I still look horrendous, but um, yeah, I'm really excited to get there and hopefully, because I've slept a while, then it means I can stay up the whole of today. I'll probably go to bed early tonight, but hopefully, I won't need time. I 
have arrived. Um, I've just gone through immigration and I'm just gonna get my bags and Isabella is five minutes away so I cannot wait to see her and see her reaction. Like she's so excited that I'm coming. So I'm so excited. Where do these bags come out? This luggage belt's very big, I don't really know. I'm gonna stand with the majority of the queue. Oh, it's just gone dark, hasn't it? Yeah. Because the lights kind of... We're now in the mall. Where are we going? Uh, we're going to Grand Harbour Restaurant. For duck. Woo! Yeah. So very excited. And we'll just show oh, you... I'm gonna die as I go down the escalator. Don't really know how many videos this is gonna be. We're just gonna see how much I get yeah. and then maybe split it. Isabella's mum is also here, but... I don't know where she's... <laughs> You're too tall. You just need to crouch the whole yeah. holiday. I do. Hi! We're at lunch. This is Isabella's mum. There's Isabella. And there's our food. And we have to eat two dogs. We'll do. And Mary Lou's gonna take me to all the tourist bits later, aren't you? Yeah. <laughs> Bearing in mind we've still we've been eating for what, maybe like 15 minutes already? Yeah, this is probably oh. only the other half. Oh my god. <laughs> so much food! So I'm back at Isabella's apartment now. I'm just in my room chilling for a little bit. She's had to go out because she's got something to do. And her mum is taking me out to like the markets and stuff, I think, and Chinatown. And then we're going to meet Isabella. And then I'm meeting her friends later on. So I'm just going to relax for, I think, like half an hour. We're going to leave because um, obviously I flew overnight. So I'm a little bit tired. But I think if I keep going, then I'll be fine. It is the second day in Malaysia. Woo! Um, I didn't film much yesterday afternoon because you saw the stuff where Isabella and I's mum went to all the like, what's it called? Central Market, Central, Chinatown yeah. stuff. Did then we came down. It? I like filmed some of it. Ooh. And um, then we went and met Isabella on her shoot because she's such a model. And then we all went, oh, we're okay. getting told to move. Okay. And then Bye. we went for dinner. Oh. We had Thai food, which was really good. Oh, we're actually going. And then, what did you have to that? Oh, I came home and literally crashed out. I mean, it was like half 10 anyway. I was really, yeah. really tired. And I slept for 12 hours. And then Isabella came and woke me this morning. And now we're going to the- Batu Caves. Yeah, the so. Temples. And we're gonna meet her friend there as well. So hopefully I'll be able to film some of that. And yeah, let's go. Yeah. We're here. I mean, you can't really see. I don't even know how to zoom in on this camera. There they're over there. How do I zoom in? No idea. <laughs> okay, they just took them, no problem. <laughs> <laughs> oh, two, that's greedy. Greedy? <laughs> okay, just take another banana and go. Okay, we're done. Oh, fine, take another one too. <laughs> Just take one. Just take it. Not all of it. <laughs> oh, he's hanging on to the bag. Oh my gosh. Okay, there you go, greedy people. Oh, I'm gonna give out Oh. Okay, take two as well. You want the last one? You want the last? Take. Yeah, I know, just take it. You're a nice one. There you go. Oh, there's oh, one more. There's more, Isabella. Okay. There you go. Oh, oh and the bag. I don't want you to take the plastic. It's bad for the environment, so can I have it back? Okay. Yeah, he just wants the banana. Okay. I'm gonna pick up the bag. <laughs> That was an experience. <laughs> Tell your monkey story. <laughs> there's a once there's a clan leader and we were having a meeting. They were like banging on the windows. Do you remember that? It was a counseling meeting. They're like, 
And I was just like, oh my god, we're gonna get killed by monkeys! <laughs> <laughs> Oh god, it's very tilted. Oh, pigeon! Pigeon! <laughs> no. Oh, the rays are good. What? The rays! But you just see the Mine look like that. Yeah. Water, water. Are you tired? Oh, I thought that monkey was just sleeping on that light. Where? In the second light. Oh, yeah! I've got gluten, no, dairy-free ice cream in a gluten-free cone. Yeah, first time in Malaysia. Look at that. Maybe you should come more often. Woo! What have you got? Bubble tea. I got bubble How tea weird. and an ice cream. Look, it's That's so cute. So cool. But it tastes so good. This and you get to like pick up the bubble. <laughs> Eat the bubble. Oh, it's on my teeth. <laughs> Hello, Isabella. Welcome to my interview. Okay, I'm ready for my interviews. I have hard-hitting questions from journalist Lucy Stewart Adams. Okay, I'm ready. Oh, wait, I'm now, Stuart Adams. Right. Or are you gonna question me? Or who do you? Actually, Daniel, you Daniel, it's our interview. Daniel's behind the camera. Wait, ready? There he is. Hello, he's got his camera as well. It's very oh good. We've we got, got double angles. Angle. <laughs> <laughs> and we've both got our gorilla, fake gorilla pods. <laughs> It's quite all right lighting, I actually. I love our buttons. That's Molly May, is that you? Sponsor us, bun people. Bun people? <laughs> the buns of the world. Oh, we've got second angle. Hello, Hello. camera two. Hi, hi, hi. Camera one. Hello. Camera, camera two. two. Hello. <laughs> I also love that we're in the middle of the mall. And we just don't care. Because you're in Malaysia and you don't know anyone, but we do. All right, so what do you guys need? So no, just, we're not. <laughs> well, yeah, we did. We just had a nice ice cream from Kind Coast. <laughs> It's not gonna focus. Hello. There we go. Fine cone. Sponsor us. Oh, we've got a third camera three over there. <laughs> Hello, <laughs> camera three. Good day for the social media. Actually, you know, I'm just saying we shouldn't be this side because this oh, is really yeah. cute. With the that is cute. Daniel's got good lighting. Ready? Look at this little hut. What? Oh, that's lovely lighting. Oh, that looks really great with the little <laughs> truck. We got the toys here. Look at that lighting, Ooh, Isabella. I know it's you. You could get your new oh profile God. picture here. You, you yeah, go and write. Uh, what are you gonna write? Th this is it. Determining. Put subscribe, <laughs> follow. <laughs> Guys, I will put his Instagram on screen now. He has cool photos. The next seventy photos on my Instagram, he will have taken. <laughs> there we go. Wow. Can everyone see Whoa. that? Do you want to put it closer? <laughs> there we go. Follow. Like, follow. <laughs> What's your YouTube channel? Oh, oh, okay, we're ready. Oh, I'm ready. Oh, there's just a guy on the corner. Isn't it just the same thing? Yeah, the same thing. Why did you, you could have just said that? <laughs> yeah, but he had to be clear, right? Like, subscribe, follow. Instagram, <laughs> like and subscribe. <laughs> Love. Happy days. <laughs> are we going to go get food? Where are we going for food, guys? You can tell oh, me. Called Nirwana and it does banana leaf. And it's pretty self-explanatory. You don't have plates. You eat it on a banana leaf. Wonderful. Everyone's excited. Some of it. Um, What's this? Uh, chicken and fish. What do I want? Dal. Dal. You can have spices. I can. Yeah, chicken and fish. No, no fish for me. Just dal, please. Thank you. That's enough. Here's Isabella walking up some much less exciting stairs. What time is it? It is almost four o'clock. Well, I meant massage time, but okay. Oh. <laughs> Don't you smell the scent? <sighs> Are you relaxed? I'm relaxed. We had ice cream, then we went to a cafe, and then we just left Isabella's friend, and now we're having massages. Oh, no, so oh yeah, we had lunch as well. I filmed a bit of that on my phone. Uh, You'll have seen that. Three hours of sleep. I'm ready to sleep here. Let's go. <laughs> Oh, it's so nice. And sleep. <laughs>